Maybe you'll eat them berries. Those berries are good for you. We gotta do it at some point, guys. I need this. Let's go for it. Let's get them. I'm gonna break these rocks. Come on. Yeah. Look out, T! Oh. No. I don't know if I have enough uh, swords for this. I'm gonna try. Crab over here? Oh, there is. No! Oh, he almost got me. Ooh! Burp, 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 burp. Got tea. Oh, he's attacking him too! Yeah, get him, buddy! Oh, yes! Oh, he distracted him for me. Lovely! I think he's dead, though. Get out, dude! Oh. That crab sacrificed himself for me. I'm gonna die from that hermit crab, though. Oh, shoot! Look out! Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, no, 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 no. All this toxic everywhere. He's toxic. Come on, man. What's spitting? Oh. Get out, look out. Get out of there. I'm gonna die. We got him, we got him. Yes, let's go. All right. Back to base. Got some stuff to show you guys. I needed that scale for uh, upgrade the bench. I was supposed to go caving today, guys. I did not do it. Dizzle got busy with building and decorating and figuring things out. Uh, I did this. I actually took that down and rebuilt it. I'll show you that in a minute. I want that. I don't care about the rest. But yeah, this is uh, starting to fill in nicely now. I extended that like I said I was. Oh, what I need to show you is over there. Hang on a second. I don't know how long that took. I did not keep track of time. Throw some random wheat out there. Might move that one a little bit over to the right. Some barrels with the waters, our watering hole over here in this, uh, this area where the villagers are trying to survive. I did end up putting um, somewhat planter boxes. I put, a, I put a little bit. It filled the space a little bit better. I picked up those bones. And then I did this to the structure. Actually, I rebuilt that. This is basically the... Um, this is the blueprint, guys. I'll be upfront and honest. I like that roof line, and I wanted to see how this looked coming off of that. Because that's from the slant, and this, I'm going against uh, away from the slant on this one this time, or different direction. So that looks just as good. The only thing I did different was I took out those walls and put the windows in. I took out those front entrances, and I did this with the fences. And then I put back the uh, grain mill and chests for... Uh, the seeds and the uh, the full uh, full fruit and stuff. So that that turned out good. I'm not sure how far I can go this way because this is gonna, probably going to be in the way. But it opened it up. Hang on a second. Sorry about that. So yeah, that's that's that. And then uh, I stopped working on this because I started messing around with uh, oh, it's about the rain. 
Well, I can go show you. If I start lightning, then I'm gonna... I'm gonna stop. But I was messing around with half walls again. You know I love half walls, guys. Half pieces. And I came up with this for the, uh... The shack. As well as you can put the machines in there, too. So I was working on this one, and I had to go get material. I figured I might as well fight that brute. Actually, let me go, um... Yeah, let me go put this away. I'll be right back. Wait for fresh daylight, and then we'll talk about this some more. We'll finish that one. I want to, I want to build two more. This is basically the uh, where the villagers are, are uh, going to sleep because they were, they're up there, and I had to move them. And I didn't want to build another large structure like this, so that's what made me uh, mess around with half walls. And I didn't want a structure like that. Well, this turned out really well. I like this. This is pretty cool. All right, I'm going to wait for a uh, fresh daylight, and then we'll be back. Rise and shine, guys. Good morning. Here in the uh, Lego Fortnite. A little bit of a rough night. I'll pick that stuff up a little later. Uh, I want to get going on this. Like I said, I've been pretty much giving some TLC over here, doing some things, and then uh, this looks really nice. Look at that. With the sunrise coming up. We still got more uh, more to do in there, too. But again, like I said, I wanted to, uh, I knew I had to move them eventually. My my plan is to keep all the machines in here, guys. I'm not going that big on this build. I know this is kind of a big structure, but again, like I said before, you know, we got more in survival. Dizzle won't be building these huge villages. Um, all right, so this, half walls. You know I love half walls. And there's options here, guys. So obviously... I don't like the choices that we have lack of. Obviously, we we started over, so when you go into surfaces, we don't have like those cabinets that Dizzle usually uses from Log Cabin. Um, not even Shogun. Like these have no storage capabilities. This doesn't even have storage capabilities. Looks nice. I'll put it in there for them. From a look standpoint, um, I put a candle on there too. Oh, I don't have the. Uh, I left that over there. Let me go grab that really quick. Take you with me. Nugget stuck right there. I don't have uh, any way of moving him other than resetting. Let's see if we can get a can. I have. I'm hiding candles behind these posts, and I did it over here too. This looks actually really nice at night, guys. I don't know if you've done this yet, but putting candles behind here. If you use these at all. You know how Diddle, Dizzle loves... Diddle. Oh my gosh. Dizzle loves half posts. For the half walls too. And hiding them behind there is really good. Worked out really well. It li plus it lights that up really nice at night. I'll probably put one more candle in here though. Let's do that. But how this... Uh, Sparked, honestly, was this, um, I can probably put it in here and show you. Let's go to roofs. Uh, this one. Like I said, I was messing around with half walls. And I'm like, let me look at this roof, because I, I don't like it. Like, it's so, it's, this part is bulky. And then I'm looking at it. Like, well, wait a minute. Looks like you can fit the small chest in there. But I had floor back there too. I don't now. It's not going to work as great. Let me actually do that really quick so you can see. Um, Actually, no, I did not. I did not have a floor net. Lie T. There we go. Oh, shoot. It fell. I moved. I had it too. Let me get this for you guys, and then I'll be right back. All right, I'm back. So basically, that's what I had at first. But then I didn't like, obviously, to see how it's so close. So then I messed around with, you know, the, the height level. And, uh... I just put two pieces of the, uh... The floor in. That is two of these. And I'll probably do a tutorial on this. I don't know if anyone has done this yet, guys. Because I have not... You know I have not messed with started. This is, this is our, our our very first like build on this. 
And then I'm like, you know what? This could be good for uh, just like our, our mini cabins that we've done and the uh, mini um, for the Shogun stuff that we've done. But you could also fit... I'm not going to destroy it. Let's finish this one. This is chit-chatting a lot. To be honest, though, it <laughs> feels kind of nice to be talking. Like I said, I've been messing around with this and doing that over there. Actually, I've been really enjoying myself t uh, today on this this game. I love recording for you guys. You know that. I've said that many times. Um, but, you know me, before I started posting these videos, I forgot what I did here to figure this out. Actually, that's off. That's why. I really enjoy just building and getting lost in this game. And that's where I was today. I was in a good spot today. Why is this still off? I used the wrong one. I used the wrong one. I did that too the very first time. I think it's this one. And I sat there fiddling with it. Like, why doesn't this fit? There you go. Now you know. <laughs> but I'll show you really quick. Not all the machines. Obviously, this one. <laughs> Uh, but you could fit any of these guys, just like the other, the mini, the mini cabins. I don't have enough resources, but that'll fit in there. It's actually, you can do a whole little juicer and grill in there together. So yeah, I messed around with this today. Uh, let's see, that's a full, it's already the full piece there. I'm trying to figure out what I need to do still. It's not all 100%. There, I kind of remember what I have to do, and I kind of don't. And then I thought, I'm like, you know, for consistency, why don't we do what we've been doing with these and bring that in? I think they look really cool. So the, the idea right now is to put four. I'm probably, I'm building this for you guys, but I'm probably, I might take it out because I might, I'm afraid to take this out because I'm afraid that's going to be destroyed. You know how sensitive those are. But if I can, or if I decide to, then I'm going to bring it over this way a little bit. So then I have room and try and keep that plant. Or we keep the rock and take out that plant. I already lost one. There was one behind here. I had to take it out. So we might lose the other, which I'm okay with. It's not that big of a deal. But then for sure, I'll be able to fit one more here and then do the opposite side of this and then have the entrance. And this will be like their little uh, little area. That'll, that'll sleep four of them. The fifth one we might put in there somewhere. I don't have my bed yet either. Actually, my bed's over there. I'm sorry. It's from, I lied. It's right over there. Let's get back to this. Uh, let's see. Is there two of those? No, we should be... We should be good now. What is under there? I don't think anything... But again, I'm still um, still trying to learn this myself. So once I get it all down, guys, I can definitely do a tutorial on it if you like. That's off. Is it off? I think it's off. This is where I messed up last time. Hang on. Oh, that one is off too. I know what it is. This this piece, guys. Um, I don't think it, that will matter. Is it that one? I'm gonna leave it like this. I think that's how I have the other one. Because it's on flush here, but the roof isn't lining up. Because this piece right here. If you haven't messed with these yet, let me turn it this way. You see how the roof line goes past that? That'll make sure that the roof line matches. You need that piece on the end, and it'll push the roof line to match with that perfectly. But I'll fix that. I'll mess around and see what pieces I need. All 
All right, so that's done. Uh, and again, you can go. Oh, we had a, a rustler. I kicked out Gus. <laughs> Picked up rustler. But again, you can go different options. You can go with this, or you can go. You can go half half beam or half shack corner. Is it this way? I think it is that way, T. Trying to look up up top to see. Okay. It's kind of hard without the beams in too, though. Let me put the beam in at least one, and then we can take this out. Then you can kind of see because you'll have options. Should be able to come off of that now. I'm not going to alternate them, guys. I'm just going to do that. Let me uh, snap off of it. Probably better. Yep. Why is that? What did I use? A full square. Why is it not lining up? Let me get up there, guys. I need to see what what. Uh... I went four. I have five here. I think I went too far back. I did. Oh, I see what I did. I messed up, guys. Right here. This might need to come out, then. I told you. <laughs> I was messing around with it, so I don't have this 100% done. That's why I said I would do a tutorial on it. Let's see if we can fix this now, then. See what pieces. And I can show you. Oh, I did it again. Dang it. Uh, I gotta take this out. Right? Yeah, that's right now. So it's that piece. That piece and then the single. So it's three pieces, no? Yeah. See? The way that piece is designed, it's got the extra lip of the roof. I learned that from uh, doing that. Remember when I couldn't figure that out? There you go. So let's take this out so you can see how it looks with the... Uh... So yeah, look at the way those pieces are flying. That rock's going to break for sure. Oh, I fell. Come on. Oh, I should have left it there, though. Dang it. Because now, I want to go off of that. Let's see. One, two, three, four. Nighttime already? Oh, man. Yeah, this is wrong. Oh, you know why it's wrong? Because now we have to use this piece. Because we fixed the roof. So this piece will work. See? One, two, three. Problem solved on the spot, guys. Four. All right.
But there you go. You, now you can see that. That's how that is. It's kind of like hanging off rather than supported. If you didn't like that, then you can also go let's see if this lines up. And then I'll wait for daylight, guys. Yeah, it does. See, then you then you can go with the this beam. Then you go back with the fences in front. So you you'll have options, guys. And then uh, again, you can put machines in here. I'll be back. Let's let daylight come, and uh, we'll wrap this up. We're back, guys. I feel like I'm in Florida right now because it rains and then it stops. It rains and then it stops. Um, so yeah, there you go, guys. I just wanted to share that. Um, again, I would you at this. I don't know exact what level that needs to be. That's something that I just kind of keep put one in and then try to make it fit to where I need to. Um, but you can access them from here too. But yeah, if this is something you guys want a tutorial on, let me know, and we can do that. Um, I'm going to finish putting in... I'm going to keep it here, take out that tree, or that tree, that bush, and do one here and then one there, and then I'll do a little bit of decoration, maybe put some uh, slap berries or something in there. And then again, some TLC, we fixed that. I still need to do this. That wasn't that main of a concern. I really wanted to get this. I'm glad I did this. I like how this turned out. Like I said, I had to take, uh, well, that's off. Shoot. I'm gonna have to fix this again. Yeah, the fence is off. Not a big deal. It'll go in, but I gotta take that all out. Straighten it out. But I really like how this turned out. Uh, I will, I'll admit, Starter Shack pieces are not my favorite. But guys, this is turning out really good. I'm liking this. Again, this is probably the size I would go in, in in a survival in a survival game. Fresh start like we're doing just now. So this is new. This is great, right? Because we never built in Dry Valley. We um never built with Starter Shack. And as well as we uh we didn't reconstruct that, but we built off of that. So that's something else we can kind of cross off the list. I know a lot of people do that out there. Like they go take a, a structure and rebuild. You know, we built around it. The story is we don't know what happened. That structure was there and we built off of that. One last look, guys, and then Dizzle's going to call it. Call this one a wrap. I was glad I was able to incorporate this. Like I said they spawn there. Pretty cool. I don't know if I'm going to do anything more over here. I think I just might leave this open. And I pu pushed that back when I rebuilt it. So that opened this space up really nice. I'm going to move that. I might come up with the fire pit for this build. This kind of fits for me, but at the same time, I, I know we always try to come up with something. Every time we uh, work with the new, uh, new pieces. So, But there you go, guys. Again, thank you for all your support uh, on both builds. Much appreciated. And uh, Dizzle will catch you on the next one.